G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Today is going to be a quick one. Uh, just having a look at the Bodhi Rook figure, the Rogue One Bodhi Rook figure, the three and three quarter inch. Um, basically this is probably the one that everybody's been hanging out for because it was wave three in the set. Uh, the other figures had come out. You got Chirrut Inway and Baze and uh, the other guys there. And pretty much those had come out. I think I've done reviews, well I've done reviews on those. A um, recent one there with the three and three quarters as well. But basically we'd all been waiting out to see Bodhi come out. So he finally arrived and I was lucky to uh, to find him in store, which is fantastic. So um, as we know with the the traditional way that the Hasbro has been going with their recent figures, uh, the articulation is limited on this, uh, very similar to the original figures that we ever got back in the early days. And you can see there, so you've just got uh, legs can go forward and back, head can rotate left and right and the arms can go up and down. Uh, the Bodhi figure, as you can see, I'll bring him over onto the white background so you can get a really good look. Uh, it comes with a couple of accessories. In this instance, it comes with a blaster. And then you can see him also coming with his backpack accessory, which is uh, the thing he's trying to plug the communication in, or basically his receiver is plugging, in, plugging into the communication tower. Uh, nice little feature there. You can see it's on string, and you can just wind it up using that. Just winds left and right, and you can... Have him display like that or you can have him on the back there so, sorry my camera's zooming out of focus get a look at the detail there it's actually quite nice good representation of the the actor then moving down you've got some nice detailing there in the the jacket and the waist and the pockets down the arm you've got the imperial insignia a couple of tools and then down into the hands and into the feet so been really great to uh to find this guy because i have been waiting to finalize the collection because that's pretty much it i'm not really a an army builder or anything like that so i've got my darth and a stormtrooper i've got my krennic and oh look he's fallen over my death trooper see if we can stand him up there a little bit tricky but anyway uh but it's great to have all the figures now uh, that are in the set. So anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, keep subscribing. Uh, thanks for thumbs up videos and all that sort of fun stuff. If you haven't, check out a couple of the other Rogue One stuff uh, that I've reviewed. This is a fantastic book if you haven't already checked out the review, so make sure you get onto that and have a look at that. If you haven't seen these guys, these are actually uh, unfortunately not poseable, but they are a Disney exclusive uh, set of 10 figures that came out uh, prior to the release of the movie. And it's just another way of displaying your figures. I really like Jared Inway, uh, in the sense that we have him with his sort of blaster, bowcaster blaster, rather than the, uh, with his, uh, pretty much his stick or his pole. Uh, and the other thing is, uh, I've got, uh, had a bit of a sale here the other day in Big W, so grabbed two of the new Series 4 microfighters. We've got the U-Wing and the um, Imperial Shuttle microfighter so i'll do a review on those as well so check those out as well but anyway thanks for liking the channel thanks for giving thumbs up to the videos um please share your thoughts feedback if you've got these figures love to hear what you think uh but anyway thanks for uh, watching subscribing cheers